In Mercer County, we have breaking news out of Sharon. One man is dead after a shooting. First News reporter Hannah Erdman joins us live from the scene with the latest. Hannah, what can you tell us so far? Yes, Sam, we've been here on scene for several hours, even before the show went on air this morning, and we are still watching as police continue investigating what led to the shooting death of 32-year-old Chad Runyon. I'll take a step back you can, for the final time to see what this scene looks like now. Several hours later, police have been very much focusing on their investigation, collecting evidence on the patio of this house right here at the intersection of Leslie Street and Baldwin Avenue. And that is where Runyon was found earlier this morning at just before 2 with multiple gunshot wounds. He was taken to the hospital where he later died. And we were able to speak with District Attorney Pete Acker here on scene earlier this morning. But first, we'll take a look at what that scene looked like. Now, when we spoke with Acker, he said that this could have been a potential drug bust gone wrong, or drug deal gone wrong, excuse me. But he doesn't know for certain. That, again, still very early in their investigation at this time. He also says that they do have a few different suspects in mind, but as of this hour, no one has been arrested in connection with this incident. So we are still working to learn a lot more information about what led to the shooting as well as those suspects and if they have or will arrest anyone in the near future. So we're hoping to continue following this and as soon as we have any new information, we will bring it to you on air and online when it's available. Reporting live in Sharon, Hannah Erdman, First News Sunday morning. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel and don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.